So here we go. We're going to build a golf club. Actually, Josh is going to build a golf club out of Golf City stickers. So guys, if you've heard the name Josh Mayer, that's because he's amassed over 1.5 million followers on TikTok, creating golf clubs out of some of the most random things you can imagine. That's right. Josh has created golf clubs out of everything from saran wrap and tin foil to Parmesan cheese and even hot glue. Well, Today, we asked Josh to come by the studio and not only show us some of his creations, we're gonna challenge him to create one of those clubs while he's here. Let's do it. Speaking of which, he's here. Let's go get him. Oh my God, look how many clubs he brought with him. Nice to meet you, nice to meet you, up, dude. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, so we got Josh Mayer here with us. And Josh, I'll tell you what, I have seen a lot of golf content in my eight plus years of doing this, and I've never seen anyone doing what you do. It's definitely different. Yeah, it's, it's definitely, definitely different. different. Yeah. And I'll tell you what, it's clearly something that is appealing because you have over 1.5 million followers on TikTok. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not 100% sure how that happened. I don't know if I'm worthy of 1.5 million, but we, we got there somehow, so we're, we're, we're working, yeah. I'll tell you what, it is cool, it is interesting, and speaking of which, I gotta have you take me through some of these creations you've brought here. Is, I mean, at this point, it's like, is there anything you haven't built a golf club with? You know, I've done I've done Parmesan cheese. I did a, a, a 3D pen. I made a, a golf club out of a 3D pen. That was a little bit interesting. That had to take you all day. It did, that took a while. The, I'll tell you what, I did a couple out of uh, wood, out of maple. That took me a while. <laughs> I, was, I was using like awful tools as well. I was, I, I think somebody told me I was using a saw that was meant for metal. I was using actually like hand chisels and like grinders and whatever they're called. Yeah, definitely not a carpenter. You are the MacGyver of golf. Yeah, that's for sure. Tell me about this one. Is this, was this? So this, yeah, so this is a putter um, and it's made out of a 3D pen. So um, I didn't know what a 3D pen was and I started looking into, I saw a couple of like other TikTokers making stuff with 3D pens. And so I looked it up, bought one off of Amazon. You can basically draw stuff and kind of comes to life. It's a 3D like, form of drawing. And so I had the idea to, to make a golf club out of it. So I made a club and then I also made a putter. And this is the uh, the putter. It's kind of a, little, I guess- Almost a Scotty. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's a little bit of a Scotty Cameron yeah. replica here. That's That was my goal uh, to try and replicate a Scotty Cameron, but- That's uh, awesome. And that, well, rough. I mean, you, you might've just started to answer that question. You said you dreamt this up, but I wanna know where are some of these ideas coming from? That's a that's a great question. I, I honestly- You must most have some them, suggestions. Yeah, I was gonna say, might. most of them are from the comments. So like. Anybody who follows me kind of knows that like the, the series that I keep going are kind of fueled by people commenting on the video and saying, yo, you should make a putter out of this or make a club out of this. And so, I mean, honestly, it's the, the people following me give me all the ideas. I'm not I'm not that much of a genius <laughs> to be able to come up with this stuff myself. So, Well, look at yeah. some of this stuff. I mean, we've got cardboard, got cardboard here. I love it. You still give the cavity back. <laughs> yeah, we got, you know, yeah. We've got duct tape. Um, just incredible. We're going to challenge you to build a club while you're here. Okay. You know, you've got the all the resources we can give you here. Whatever yeah. you want, go, we'll hunt around uh, the office a little bit, maybe find some random stuff and build a club. But I'll tell you what, I feel like you're you're bringing some people into the game, exposing the game in a, in a way that no one's thought of before. Yeah. So yeah, you'd say like, is this really golf? You know, but yeah, you know, in a lot of ways, you're, you're, you're taking these out on the course, you're doing everything. And I think in a way we talk about growing golf and growing the game for you to have somebody who may otherwise have no interest other than to see you building something you never know what that gateway is that's going to spark some more new golf for sure so we need guys like you to break yeah them i mean a I'm, little I'm bit. just having fun i enjoy golf it's a great game i think it's the greatest game on earth um i enjoy it and uh yeah i'm just trying to i guess have fun with it i'll tell you what let's uh i know these take time to do so let's hunt around a little bit and see what we're going to make a club out of all right let's get after let's go so what do you think, Mike? Think you could do some damage with this thing? I would break this thing so fast. <laughs> Look at this. Imagine how steep. Forget I would take this thing right it. in the ground, forget it. Oh, it's so light. All right, dude, so HQ is your oyster. Anything you see in here, you want to break it. Just don't break the sim, please. I can't. No promises. No promises. <laughs> but anything you want to destroy and okay. cut up and make into a golf club, feel free. All right. I, mean, I was thinking like, like instantly, like we got so much Red Bull. Okay. We could just down a bunch of Red Bull and make some out of cans. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not opposed. To, I'm not opposed to just drinking some Red Bull. Uh, that might that might be a little bit tough. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a Red Bull yeah, away. But no Red Bull. That might be a little tough. Yeah. Little aluminum. Yeah, well, let's actually. I'm not gonna cut. Let's go over there to that. I think there's some stuff over here we okay. could probably work with. So I like your attention to detail on these things. The grooves. What could we make over here? What, what looks good? These are, are those eggs or what? No, these, <laughs> these are golf balls that we, uh, we're nice, gonna be nice. cutting for uh, for our TikTok mm. channel. Uh, some old 
oh, golf balls there. Holy cow. Spaldings. They might just like disappear. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. They're gonna, there's definitely rubber bands inside of those. <laughs> but I don't know, man. What do you see here? Boxes? How about, probably wouldn't be able to do it. have like a mug. Maybe maybe some stickers? That's probably something I did want to like duct tape. That might oh, be. Oh, so, so similar to this one you similar did. Similar to that guy? Yeah, Golficity stickers. We can, make, we can make that work. I don't know. You think we got enough? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you're the best. You can, you can you're the master I mean, club builder here. I mean, that's a. I think we had a good. That's map. a pretty thick amount of stickers. Yeah, yeah. Come on, look at that. Like, All right, right so, off the bat, you can kind of see it's it's thick enough. So here we go. We're gonna build a golf club. Actually, Josh is gonna build a golf club out of golf city stickers. You guys are just gonna watch while I'm working hard building a golf club. Exactly. We're here to help yeah, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's we can. Yeah. <laughs> you guys just work on the simulator, and I'll uh, I'll build a little club here. Yeah. All right. So let's give you a workstation, and we're gonna put you to work. I think right here. So I'm thinking. My, my thought is I'm gonna start with these like rectangular ones here. I'm gonna kind of like lay them all out, get myself like a base, stick those down like to the size of a, of a golf club, stick those down, mm -hmm. and then kind of go in and draw out like the shape of a golf club. Cut that out, and then just start just start sticking, just start going, Love it. going ham, sticking these guys on there, and just, <laughs> yeah. just just going add nuts. A little bit of weight, right? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. And and just for our audience, you you do what we call the gauntlet when you test these things. So so what is that? It's a gauntlet. Like? So we're gonna we're gonna swing we're gonna swing the club when it's finished. Um, I'm gonna hit a ping pong ball. If it survives the ping pong ball, then I'm gonna hit a plastic golf ball. If it survives the plastic golf ball, then we've got an actual golf ball. And if it survives that, which only one club has ever survived that, then we got a little something special after that. So okay. you know, kind of keep you keep you engaged here. We might be getting to that special thing, but it's you know it's it's a little bit of a long shot. Here. I love it. All right, man. We're gonna let you get to work. Do your best, man. Let's, Let's go. go. <laughs> Let's go. Set this guy up here. This is the moment of truth right here. All right, so what are we doing here? All right, so. My idea here is kind of lay it out. This is kind of our base. Yep. I'm gonna then get a little, uh, I guess, an outline of this club. Okay. And then cut around that. Then we have our base, and then we just start sticking. <laughs> there we go. Yep. We're just sticking. That's probably the easy part. Yeah, that's yeah. for sure the easy part. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna go for it here. All right, bang. There it is. There it is. There it is. Easy as that. There's our club right Boom. there. Boom. And we start cutting. Oh, there we are. Now we're looking. Starting to come along here. Look at that. Just like that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try and build up the back of it first, I guess. Okay. Pretty happy with that first stick there. So as you work your way through that, the other thing I got to ask you about is sometimes you, you play with some of the most ridiculous items. Mm. I saw you, I saw you try to play with a pineapple. <laughs> Uh, I think one of my favorites was you playing with the iced coffee. Okay, the Charlie. Yes. Yeah, the Charlie. That's a, you know, I, I had to shout out to my fellow TikTokers, yeah. Charlie D'Amelio with the, the Dunkin' Donuts drink. I'll tell you what, what, what are some of the reactions of other people on the course when they see you playing a par four with, with a iced coffee? That's probably, that's like definitely one of the biggest questions I get. Um, I try and stay pretty sneaky. I'm going to be honest. Like I try and, I try and get in and get out as quick as I can, hide in the trees, yeah. um, hoping that nobody sees me. Uh, but yeah, I've gotten some pretty weird, uh, some weird looks. Uh, I actually had one guy try and steal my golf ball while I was out there. So I have this SpongeBob ball that I play with, and I guess this guy just thought I was on there messing around. So he picked up my ball and started going down the course. I had to run after him and be like, "Yo, man! Like you have no idea. This is a big deal. Like that's a SpongeBob ball. You can't be stealing it." Um, and so I ended up getting it back, and we're, we're, we're still rolling with the SpongeBob ball. But yeah, I guess I definitely get some weird looks. Um, Dude, you played a whole entire hole using a bicycle. A bicycle? Like that was you that one was weird. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that one was that one was kind of nice. Like the street. Right, right. Uh, that was in the that was in the winter, so there wasn't that many people on the course, which was nice. Uh, but yeah, probably probably should have caught some heat for that one. But I, I stayed, like That's I great. said, I stayed pretty low key. You know, I'm in and out of the trees. I, I'm bobbing and weaving, hiding behind trees and stuff. So um, yeah, that one was interesting. The one that probably got me the most dirty looks was a uh, a propane tank. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I played a part four with a propane tank. Uh, the group in front of me was <laughs> like, they turned around and they're like, yo, what the heck are you? They were like some college guys. They're like, yo, what the heck are you doing, man? I'm like, what does it look like I'm doing? I'm, I'm playing a, I'm playing a hole with a propane tank right now. Like, so, yeah, that was, that awesome. was a good one. All right, let's keep going on the stickers. All right, let's do it. All right, we're making some real progress here. I see that you've got it attached to the 
shaft. We're, com we're, we're coming along nicely here. These stickers are actually pretty easy to work with. <sighs> what I'm trying, as you can kind of see, I'm trying to get the little cavity back here, get a little more weight on the bottom. I feel like that, you know, as far as distance goes, you're really gonna get your, your best distance if you got a little more weight down there. I got the extra, little extra oomph. And then, yeah, connected to the shaft, I mean, as you can see, that's pretty thick there. Uh, it's pretty tight. It's feeling pretty sturdy. That's that's the hardest part. That's where it's gonna break, if it is gonna break. So we're gonna make some, uh, put some finishing touches on this thing, and, and, and I think she's ready to swing. We've got a gauntlet yeah. uh, prediction or what? You think gauntlet prediction, I think it's gonna go all the way. Oh, okay. I do. I, after, after feeling the connection here, I think it's gonna go all the way. Yeah, I like it. that's all my right. prediction. Let's finish her up. Nice fresh groove. Oh yeah. yeah have the fresh grooves. Make sure they're clean as well. Yeah. That's, that's major key. All right, so in total guys, do 200 stickers to make a golf club. It's about to be 201. <laughs> there we go. There it is, final touch. The sweet spot, I guess, right? The That's sweet spot. Ooh, you think you can square that up? <laughs> you think you can square that up, square Mike? That up. Yeah, you think you can square that up, Mike? <laughs> That's great. That's Bang. the sweet spot. All right, so now we test. Now we test her out. What do you think, Mike? Nice even weight distribution? It's definitely a feather, you know? <laughs> You're right, it's like a zero iron. Oh, this is gonna break so fast, I think. Come on, no faith. It's definitely gonna pass step one, step two, I think. Golf ball, real golf ball, I don't know. No shot. All right, so the club is ready, and now Josh is gonna take it through what he calls the gauntlet. And if you've been following him on TikTok, you know what that means. But for anybody else who's new, basically, we're gonna start with a ping pong ball and see if the club survives. If it survives that, we're gonna move on to a wiffle ball. If it survives the wiffle ball, we're going real golf ball. I don't know, we all kind of think we might make it. What do you guys think? Let's see. Ooh, a little low. Picked it up. Oh, picked it up. Nice. Look at that run. Over 100 yards, yards. over 100. 92, oh, 92 yards, I'm not, I'm okay with that. Oh, check this out. She wow. did, a little, did a little damage. That's the kind of sturdiness we're working with here. A little damage there to the uh, ping pong ball. That's what we like to see. Let's get an update on the club. Update on the club. She's good. Chilling. Okay. Yeah. All right, stage one is passed. Nice, Ooh. rip. All right. Nice, Woo. 125. Stingers. <laughs> We're still looking good as far as damage goes. It's, uh, it's holding up pretty good. All right, I wanna know right now, guys, comment below, will this survive the real golf ball? I think it will after seeing those two, to be honest with you. I'm trying to feel like the weight comparison. Like, what's the what's the science on here? I don't is think it, it's going far, but I think it's going to hold gonna up. Hit, you think it's going to hold up? I think you might hit a shank like 30 yards. <laughs> That's what I think. Honestly, you guys might want to back up yeah. a little bit. Right, no, let's... <laughs> All right, here it is. Moment of truth. Whoa! Oh, that looked pretty good. It held up. There it is. Didn't get much air, but. 88 yards. 88 yards. I think ball. that maybe like went down into the ground before it actually got Would up, you say this is one of the most sturdiest clubs you've ever made then? I mean, I feel like I gotta say that, yeah. <laughs> right? Got hey. the nice. <laughs> Golf is what you make it, and there are a lot of different ways to enjoy this game. We found a new one today, that is for sure. So I'll tell you what, guys, make sure you subscribe to Josh's YouTube channel and drop in the comments and let Josh know what you want him to build a club out of next. And then guess what? Josh is gonna build it on his channel. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be looking at the comments, seeing what you guys got in there, and then I'm gonna build another club off of your guys' comments on my channel. Get creative, challenge him, make sure you subscribe to Josh's channel. We'll see you guys soon.